Hello, praise God. Today is the two year anniversary since I found Five Hope Church. It was the 1st of October in 2021 that it happened. And I just feel myself like right now just being so excited and filled with the joy of the Lord because of just thinking back and like thinking and watching and reflecting how God has transformed me so much. I could not have been at this place in my life without God, without being planted at Fivefold Church. And my heart is just overflowing literally with gratitude that God has been so good to lead me to such a well of revival, of his power, of his goodness. And it just like he has just poured so many blessings in my life. I've been challenged like these two years, like never before in my life, but I've also never felt more alive and I've never felt as much as who God created me to be. Like every single day I'm filled with I'm walking in more freedom, in more revelation of our authority, in more revelation of God's love for me every single day it grows. And like I've seen this process of endurance. I've been serving God and I've not seen almost anything like get back physically to me, but I see that God has been molding my heart in this time. He's transformed me and I'm not the same person I was even two years ago when I first discovered Fivefold Church. I have transformed so, so, so much. So I want to take this day to remember and celebrate this day. I honor my spiritual mom, Paul Catherine Crick. I would not be where I am today without her surrender and obedience to God. I'm so grateful. Like. It was so it was at a time where I was so confused two years ago I was so confused and I was seeking God like never before and God was so good to lead me like one day her YouTube video came up and I was so intrigued and I had never heard someone teach like that in my entire life I was intrigued by the words I could understand the words and I grew so much spiritually I actually found some videos from 2021 when I had just discovered her channel so I'm gonna to cut these in at the end so you can see like the crazy transformation that God has done in me. He's transformed me so much and I'm so grateful and I'm so excited for what the future holds. Like where God is going to take me. He is so good. You need to surrender to him. You need to be in his will. It's the best thing ever. And yes, it's hard sometimes, but yes, it's worth it. Stay planted. Keep seeking God. Never give up. Never ever lose the fear of God. Never ever step out of his will. He is so faithful and it's so, so worth it to stay in his will. And I'm just like amazed at how God has molded my heart. I never thought that I could love people. I never thought that I could have patience, but I'm finding myself having patience and loving people as I've just been faithful, continuing to serve, continuing to show up every single Sunday, every live, like just the faithfulness, the endurance, it really, God does wonders as we just like say yes to him so praise god i'm so full of the joy of the lord today i'm celebrating my two-year anniversary at fivefold church i'm so 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 grateful praise god but i've discovered this amazing woman uh, apostle catherine crick on youtube like it's a revival right now it's amazing i i'm so encouraged by her videos and i feel like it feels so good like in my spirit i guess to to just receive like her teachings because she really has like an anointing from god which is like yeah what is that even it's like his presence and like his power is really strong within her because uh, she's so humble and she really surrenders everything to god and it's so inspiring so i really recommend you to watch them and to get encouraged by her and to just receive the truth that that God is like sharing through her and God has spoken to me through these videos and I feel more free than I ever have before and it's crazy and I'm so grateful to God that I get to to be happy again and that I get to feel free and that I get to be myself. There's some steps that God really, really led me, like I could not have figured this out on my own, but he led me to an apostle of God. Her name is Apostle Catherine Crick, and it was really like a divine guidance to find her channel. She posts so much, and 
I have been so enormously blessed by her cha channel like I cannot even begin to describe how much I've learned like my spiritual eyes have opened so much I've grown so much in my faith and I have discovered more about who God really is and I've discovered more about like the authority that we have uh, in this world and that God wants us to have abundant life now like as Christians it's not just oh we'll go to heaven when we die no, it's like now, right now. God wants us to live in abundance right now. I've just learned so much and I've received so much life and so much like... I've seen the love of God through Apostle Catherine Crick. I've been challenged by her. I've been like a bit unsure. I've been questioning, doubting, but I've always come back humbly before God and like, okay, <laughs> I, I need you. <laughs> like, I can't do it on my own. I'm really, really thankful for that. Like, I think that's the highlight of my year, finding her channel. It's been life-changing and absolutely incredible. And I'm so excited for, like, what God has in store for her. In 2022, she's going to start ministering all over the world. And I really hope I can get to see her someday. But if not, like, I'm just so blessed by being able to be a part of it online. Praise God for transforming me. <laughs>